Hi friends, in Planet Earth Dating, it's Wednesday, March 23rd, 2016. Ra and Phil here in the Lynn Life, and there is a Ra presence in the Jamie Body Mind whose name we haven't yet caught. Other teammates are in other dimensions, most of us in the subatomic, and most of us in the physical. There seems to be a lot of argument about that, but that's still true. Being present is not the defining characteristic of a team member. A team member keeps the search for truth rules and does the search for truth work, which is clearing the lies from the smaller subatomic so that those smaller levels stand a chance of discerning what's true for themselves and for the worlds around them. As always, our foundational intention is to do what is ours to do right now in all dimensions to manifest the divine plan. With that, the formally videoed portions of today's efforts begin. I feel my fingers being slammed in a desk drawer. That's a, that's a desk, and this person just earned the upload of the lies. That's true. That wasn't nice, friend. That's true. Clearing the lies from smaller subatomic levels up through us onto that desk. Well, I can't quite reach the desk because he slammed my fingers, but I can reach his lap. That's true. And here you go, friend. A more personal delivery. <laughs> You're the one who did that. That's true. I was trying to put it on your desk. He's reacting like it's a McDonald's coffee spill. That's true. Outraged. Yeah. You're the one who slammed the fingers. I was going for the desktop. You're That's the one true. who did that. That's true. That's a common error pattern, actually. The, we think that there's some easier way, and this is almost universally true for experiences of sentience. That's true. When the work is presented to us, we think, wow, that's impossibly difficult. That's way too hard. I can't possibly be expected to do that, and therefore I shall block it. And then what happens next is even more unpleasant. And that's simply how the system works. That's true. We've all made that mistake. I'm not looking down my nose at you. No. But now's the time to get up and do something. Now, right now. Let's screen out all who wish, who refuse to acknowledge obvious, obvious realities. realities. All who refuse to acknowledge obvious realities to the base of thing 37. That screen especially from this desk and above, because that's where it got hard to get the screen through the thicket of lies. That is true. So these are the presences who are refusing to acknowledge obvious realities most fully within our experience right now. It's true. <laughs> Sending them to the base of thing 37. Free ride. Free ride. Help an abused child. Turn around and help someone. Can you think of anyone who deserves help more than an abused child? Help that presence. That's why we're delivering you there, so that you can accrue some good karma for a change. And they're arguing. That's what those J's are. You don't, That's you don't true. need to send us blue J's. We can hear you arguing just fine. It's still true. I feel another one of those really big, hard lies starting to tilt the pillar at the very base of the expansion oh zone. Oh, good. Oh, good. Goody, goody, really gumdrops. Good Ring the bell. Ring Everybody the bell. wants to be part of this extraction effort. Now is the time to convene an expansion zone. Come on, let's get this big hunk of valuable evidence up and out, whole in its entirety and the upstairs crew be headed for, or the crew who wishes to lead the charge upstairs, find the biggest executive desk you can reach that's straight up the pillar. Stay on the central axis. We're going to dump this on that desk. Someone is asking, what is this evidence of? We don't know. We'll know when know. we get there. That's true. Good question. That's a good We're question. We're delivering it for analysis. They really don't like that answer. Oh well. What do we know? We know that what we've been discovering in this subatomic expansion effort, excavation effort, is the lies that are foundational to the life in larger levels. That's These are true. the things that are tripping up everybody. Uh, for example, in sea level zone, the predominant lie seems to be uh, that selfishness works. 
that's true that it's a valid strategy for success kind yes of. that selfishness is a valid strategy for success very well put and down here in this deeper effort it's possible it has something to do with not learning from the mistakes of others that that's, that's a true. valid strategy because that keeps coming up that's true it's also possible it's something else but that's what the raw presences down there keep Tripping acting up. out right. and we know that the raw presences aren't generating the lies at their level they're expressing the lies that are coming up from the deeper levels that's true so that if I had to if I had to place a bet right now that's what I'd place my chip on but it could be something dramatically different that's it, true. we've also been working with presences who refuse to acknowledge obvious realities it's possible part of a this lie is that refusing to acknowledge obvious realities is a valid strategy for success that could be mm. it could be some combination, combination. Try to get an executive desk. Don't get a secretary's desk. That's don't get true. a clerical desk. Don't burden those people who don't have the authority with the responsibility. That's equally... I well, it's not quite as icky as dumping it into a child, but it isn't nice. That's true. Find the person who has the authority to correct the problem. Dump this on their desk. There we go. Woo! There's that world turning upside down feeling. That's true. Piling it up. I see that person whose office we just dumped this into. That's true. Doesn't want to look at it. No. Doesn't want to deal with it. And someone above them is watching. And, and watching the clock. Watching the clock. A window of opportunity is getting ready to close. That's what's happening for you, friend. Your window of opportunity is getting ready to close. Just so you know. I don't know what it's an opportunity for. Don't ask me. Go over. I know what you're supposed to do. Go over, pick that up, and see if you can figure out what it is. That's, That's what true. you're supposed to do. Do it. And we assume they're going to do nothing. That's what game theory would say. Live streaming up. And now pulse up. <laughs> now that that thing is out, we can use the bulb syringe technique to clear the gunk that was trapped underneath it. It feels sludgy. That's true, liquidy. Liquidy. And do it for ourselves and, and for, for those smaller than we are. That's Not true. just for ourselves, for ourselves and for those smaller than we are. Running it through our spines. Being of service to the smaller ones, the less capable ones, the ones that are being hurt by it more. That's true. Because it smells bad in our offices so to speak but they're drowning in it that's true it's taking down Jack says it's taking down our loved ones it's true it is taking down our loved ones when they give in to it it does that's why our f we have to assume our friends aren't coming back the ones who have left we assume we'll never see them again that's true odds are good we won't see them again unfortunately and sometimes they surprise us and return. Joseph, assume they aren't coming back. I see how he has a different set of friends that he's mourning. That's true. But it's the same pattern. They aren't coming back. Assume they aren't coming back. And it's more than assume it. Really grieve it. They aren't coming back. You can look through the records of all the people who have come and gone here. Once they don't return after a week or so, they just don't come back. That's true. They don't. They're How gone. long has it been since you've seen Charles? He was a good guy. Great to work with. That's true. Et cetera, et cetera. We could give you a really long list of names, but it would make it really uh, clumsy to post this on YouTube, so we're not going to do that. That's true. But think about Pan. If you want to think about anybody, think about Pan. They aren't coming back. They aren't coming back. And knowing how way leads on to way, even after the awakening, unless they've been doing their personal growth work on the other side, ours, our paths won't cross, unfortunately. Because when people decide to stop growing, they really do, and then they immediately start shrinking and becoming smaller and less than they were before.
That's true. And so somebody is choosing to grow and someone else chooses to stop growing, whew, that difference gets huge and it gets huge really fast. That's true. You can feel someone starting to let go. Yeah. They aren't coming. They aren't coming. That person who you're mourning doesn't even exist anymore, really, because he made the choice to stop growing, and now he has become something disgusting, much less than he was then, unfortunately. And now the question is, what do you choose to do? Very well put. This is a life event. Do you choose to use it as an excuse to also stop growing? Or do you choose to use it as motivation to become more than you have been? To rise above it? To become a better person? To continue to grow? Look how somebody's wanting to hold on. They aren't coming. Friends, they aren't, they aren't coming. coming. Sort 10% ten percent most, most true, true from 90% least true and right away burn the 90% least true. They aren't coming. They aren't coming. They aren't coming. Remember what the Dalai Lama said. What matters most on this spiritual path is the company we keep. You sleep with pigs, you get to smell like pigs. Thank, Thank you, you, Rich Confessori. Let's screen out all oh. who wish who refuse to acknowledge obvious realities. Because some people might wish to ignore obvious realities, but still do it. That's true. Pull their head out of wherever it's wedged <laughs> and do what's needed anyway. They might. Because we wish a lot of things. We wish a lot of things. But for those who refuse to acknowledge obvious realities, the search for truth pillar by definition isn't your right place. Go someplace else. Go anyplace else, actually. We're giving you a free ride to an abused child so that you can be of service That's and accrue true. some grace. And you'll either take it or you'll run away. That's true. Like a selfish coward. That's true. We prove with our actions who we really are. Over and over again. And over and over and over and over again. On our eternal path. That's true. Intending to get it up under the highest executive desk we can. Oh, that's a good idea. Sending it up. I'm also putting it in places like safes. I found a couple safes just that's now, true. and I'm putting this stuff in the safes. Babies aren't in safes. No. And people without authority typically don't even have safes. That's true. So if you find a safe, I think you could put this stuff in a safe safely. <laughs> That's true. Setting it up. Make it right. They won't. No. I don't really trust them. When we say make it right, they could say, oh, I'll make it right. Right. You know? Right. That's true. Maybe correct that Raise error. the vibration higher. Raise the vibration higher. That's but I don't proof. think you can. Raise the vibration, vibration higher. higher. Here's the work. Now raise, raise the, the vibration, vibration higher. higher. Oh, that feels different. That's Better. True. Here's the work. Now raise, raise the, the vibration, vibration higher. We have to be so precise with these people. They're so That's slimy. True. Right, because they could say, yeah, I'll make it right. I'll wipe it right off the face of history. Right. That's true.